Hello all, it is Happy Summer and welcome to another video on my channel. This is part two of the return of my Wakefield legacy and I'm so excited to be recording this again. It just makes me so happy because this was a let's play that I just loved playing so, so much and I just really wanted to get back into it and back into my game. So again, this is part two. So we actually have Sawyer and Paisley. So again, they're sisters and they're chilling here um, at the flea market. And um, I apparently Sawyer's like into this kind of thing, which is really cute. And I'm having them take a picture together because I just feel like, look at how similar they are. They're like so similar, yet they also look different at the same time. So it's great. Like, I mean, their facial structures are different, but like they have the same hair color and eyes and it's really cute. Oh no, what's this? Oh, Sleepy Sleepy from Sleep Disorder. Oh, Justine's calling us. It's good to hear your voice, Paisley. I wanted to ask you if I should get to know Isaiah Goth a little better. Um, We're going to say we're not sure because we don't know who he is. So I mean, okay. But yeah, we're going to just socialize with Paisley a little bit. Um, She definitely wants to be a little bit mischievous. But then we're also going to kind of tell her how we have really just kind of been feeling very alone and you know, it's really hard to see other couples together, especially since our husband died. Or not especially since, but since our husband died. Um, it's been really, really hard for Paisley. And so Paisley is just having so much fun with her sister. They're so cute. They have the deeply connected sentiment, which is so sweet. Like, absolutely so sweet. But, um, okay, you want to become playable. Well, we're going to kind of just walk around and see what is at this um little who's brendan who's kiara is this kiara cameron um anyway so we're just gonna kind of walk around and see what is going on with this we need to haggle with a vendor that's like our little goal for this um little challenge and i don't know if we're gonna get anything okay but as i say that to be honest this matches our house 75 simoleons where's the vendor for this area. Are you a vendor? No. Jonathan Davis. Um, let's go ahead and who is he? Jonathan Davis. Hello. Um, we're gonna go and haggle with him and hopefully that'll give us what we need. Are you crazy? I'm already losing money at these prices. Oh snap, he did not he did not like that at all. What's this? Um, heartless haggler. Oh no, she's sad. Okay, we're gonna go and buy this um, intelligence desk chair. There we go. Be sure to check your household inventory next time you are done. Okay, so we have that in our inventory, which is... Did you hear the siren? This is coming from the game. That is so cool. I have never heard that before in the game. That is so awesome. Why do I feel like I know you? Taku. Oh, it's Taku. Oh, that's why. Did you buy food? Can you go? Apparently, that wasn't her that bought the food. But she was hungry, so we're going to order some food. She is a vegetarian, though, so I need to, like, be careful that she gets what she needs or that she can get something that's vegetarian. I don't think any of those things are going to be vegetarians. We can get Bell Puri. Whatever this is over here, we can get... That'll help. Also, I'm still sick, <clears throat> which is lovely. Um, <laughs> first time being sick since, since actually during the whole pandemic. Um, finally, finally fell down with the pandemic, if you want to say it that way. So, that's lovely. But, um, anyway, so that's why I apologize for my voice again. It's kind of worse than it was yesterday, but it's all good. Um, anyway. So she is eating her bell puree, and how are you feeling about, oh my word, it must be very spicy. Girl, are you good? He's like, are you good? Why does he look so sad? He literally looks so sad, but also that looks so good. Okay, she's finally like almost done with her food. Oop, can we... Yeah, I think she's technically done. She's still talking about something. They're just having, like, a really good, like, girls' day. Which, by the way, um, I'm actually going to pop into Sawyer's household um, after this little event here. Um, I just kind of want to see if there are any 
adult sims that we run into that happen to be single and you're probably like um why in the world are you doing that well that's just because she definitely is not one to be single that's just not really something that she enjoys doing okay who are you everyone's married (laughs) that's okay but we'll see I mean maybe she'll run into somebody later on I don't really know but let's see um there's still two hours remaining of this little event here um we did buy that one that one chair is there anything else she could buy there isn't actually that much stuff here um we're not gonna go into floral landscaping I'm sorry but that's just not gonna happen there's no paintings up here, which I think other sims, or not other sims, I think I would have to put a painting up there. Um, I think that's kind of like open to the simmers, but anyway. Oh, we can toss a coin in there. Oh, my hair is so pretty. Look at the little elephant. I love it. Um, She has eaten food from the city. Awesome. How does she feel? A spicy burn. She's uncomfortable and she's feeling very hot. Girl, you're going to be fine. Um, Oh, look at that. Um, Let's actually have her be funny with her sister. She wants to become playful, so maybe maybe this will help a little bit. Oh my goodness, they're so cute. I absolutely love Paisley, and I also love Sawyer. Sawyer is like, I don't know, they're just so cute. Look at how cute they are. Oh, I love it, I love it. They're just sister goals. We're going to joke about fashion. Um. Oh, we have Junior Barry. Okay. Oh, he's single. But he is just not very cute. I don't know. I'm not really a fan. Not really a fan of him. Sorry. Oh my goodness. Look at them playing. They're so cute. I don't think... Oh yes, she did get playful. That's amazing. Okay. Um. Ooh, sing a karaoke duet. Maybe they should go do some karaoke since we're literally right here. Where... Wait, hang on. Where's the lot? Oh, oh, oh. This is the lot? I don't remember. I must have placed this one down. Is it even... A- does it have a karaoke thing? Um, there's some bubble blowers. If we go downstairs, I don't see a thingy for karaoke. Am I just being blind? Oh, yes, because they're all over here. Oh, but we can't sing a duet because I don't think she has a high enough skill. So we're just going to skip that for now. Oh, look at that. Oh, I want a cloud gaze. It's raining, though. It is raining, so I don't know if that's going to happen. Alonzo. Oh, he's married. Oh, this is all just getting, this is so cute. Look at everybody. Um, Dan. Um, I feel like he'd be kind of cute if he didn't have his hair. Excuse me. I don't know the way it is. Okay. Um, this is a no, and he also has the first name of our deceased husband. So that's kind of weird. Um, okay, you want to cloud gaze with Sawyer so bad? Oh, I don't, I don't know what to, what to do about that, because it's raining. That's just going to be the excuse for everything. But you're definitely just kind of getting to know um the dynamic between them. Um, excuse me, her shirt got deleted. Are you going to talk to us though? Let's give her a polite introduction. Maybe we could have a friend. Are we going to have a friend? Hello. It is nice to meet you. Let's see if they get along. Um. Maybe we will have a new friend. That's kind of awkward to go up to a stranger and ask her for a DNA sample. That's definitely not what I had pictured happening at the flea market. Um, that's okay. Okay, so we're going to get to know her traits and see. Oh, she's outgoing. That's a plus. She's outgoing, active, and childish. Oh my gosh, she totally, we totally could be friends with her. Sharon Securities. No, don't leave. Don't leave. We want to be, we want to still talk to you. Who is this? Who are you? Um, wait, what's your name? Your name is Veronica Graves. And this is Caleb Graves. Are they, your spouse is India. Oh, they must be siblings, maybe. I don't know. They do not look anything alike, but they must be siblings. Okay, well, this is really cute. Are we going to have like a friend? Oh my goodness. I want to have them like, is she an adult too? She is. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we have a friend. We're going to have to give her a makeover. That's going to be so fun. I also totally want to do like makeovers for the different Sims um, and like maybe post them on my channel too. I don't know. Um, I think it's just kind of fun. Okay. 
so we're gonna go home now we are definitely feeling like actually hang on i'm gonna do it this way we're gonna go um save and go to manage worlds and then i'm gonna pop in with sawyer and her family so you can kind of get to know the dynamic there i might fix a couple things with the house because i'm not really sure if i have necessarily like done anything with it recently okay where do they live though i need to look klein oasis springs okay and I know they're technically not Wakefields, but um, Sawyer is a Wakefield, so that's that's that. <laughs> Here's their house. Okay, like I said, I'm not sure if I've actually played with them recently. And I also need to see if their house even has furniture in it, because sometimes my Sims will move into empty houses. I don't know why or how that happens. I'm sure there's like a fix for it somewhere, but it is kind of annoying. So, oh, and Sawyer literally is late for work. Okay, but she's grilling something. She's grilling something, so I don't really know what to do about that. So, okay. Um, we have a lot of things that we need to, to do here. First off, you need to take your vitamin. Oh my goodness, oh, she gets to be a teen. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited, you guys. I'm so excited. Paige, which is the daughter, she gets to be a teen. We're going to go have her taste this frosting because I want her to age up really bad. Okay, why are you not going to work? Can you please go to work? I'm also going to um, promote her to... What level are you? She's level 70. I'm going to promote her to level 8. Um, okay. Let's go. Oh my goodness. She gets to be a teen. I'm so excited. So she's a genius. She also has loves the outdoors. I'm going to quickly um, randomize um, an aspiration for her because I'm really bad at picking aspirations. So let's do this. We got city, city native, but I just don't feel like she loves the outdoors, so I don't, I'm not going to go for that. It just doesn't work for her. To me, um, oh, we have the perfectly pristine, uh, where is that even going to be location? But I really don't want her to have that either. Maybe if she was neat or something or a perfectionist, but okay, we have artistic prodigy. I'm just not feeling these aspirations for her. I'm trying to find one that, um, Usually if I randomize it, it'll work great, but these are just not working for what I want. There's like, um, what's that one? I don't know what this one is. Is it here? I don't know how to pick that one because I don't know what that one is. Oh wait, it's this one. Fabulously filthy. No, we're not going to do that either. <laughs> she was a slob. Um, okay. Best selling author. Now that I could see, I could see her being a best selling author. She's a genius. She could like write like nonfiction or something about like the outdoors, like almost like a biologist. I could see it. I can totally see that. So we're going to add some candles. Yay. I'm so excited for her. Um, Wait a second. You need to brush your teeth really bad. Go ahead and do that, my dear. And then um, I'm going to have her quickly um, get some of these things taken care of. But prime first and most prior. What am I trying to say? I don't know anymore. Um, I'm going to get rid of all of what we do not need. It looks like she has allergies. I'm just going to get rid of those things. And then she can take, oh, I guess she doesn't have to take her vitamin right now. General allergies. Um, she definitely wants to chat with her dad, though. So this is Kevin. Um, let's see. Let's, oop, where was the share? Share brilliant ideas. Here we go. Go ahead and share brilliant ideas. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Aw, they're so cute. They are literally so cute. Father, daughter, goals. Um, and she wants to get to know him. So um, her, as you saw, she is a genius and loves the outdoors. She also has general allergies and a normal immune system. And then, as you know, she has a best-selling author aspiration. We need to enroll her in school, however. So we're going to do that in a second. Um, let's tell him a funny story. And then we need, whoops, we need to enroll her in school. He wants to earn a thousand simoleons and browse the Simpedia. Okay. But here is enroll in local public school. Enroll page. Actually, we could bring her to a boarding school. We could put her into a boarding school because I feel like just because she's so smart, you know what I mean? So what does that do? I've never done that before. School, enroll in virtual school, enroll in local public school, uh, maybe, maybe I can't do the boarding school, 
Maybe that's not a thing anymore. Okay, well, we're just going to enroll her in the local public school then. She is in robotics, tech and robotics, but I think I'll have her stay in that because I just think that would be really cute. Okay, she's enrolled in that now, and we're going to have her do her homework. We're going to have her work on that. Oh, you need to brush your teeth too. Gross. Oh, he was literally in the bathroom. I could have had him do that in there, but oh well. Okay, go and use the bathroom. Um, yeah, I definitely need to um, give her a makeover ASAP, but I'm just kind of waiting. Um, I was going to wait a little bit, but I might just, I don't know, I'll, I'll wait till the next part to do it. So my apologies. Oh my goodness. Um, while searching through the agency's database, Sawyer uncovered a government plot to spy on top ranking officials in other allied nations. This behavior flies in the face of the pledge Sawyer took when joining the agency, and she finds herself conflicted about what to do next. Will Sawyer act as a whistleblower and take the documents to the press or keep her head down and ignore what she found? Oh no, I don't know what to have her do, you guys. What would Sawyer do? Maybe I'm going to use a number random a number generator for this from one to two, and one is going to be the first option, and two will be the second, so random number generator one to two okay generate okay we got one so she's gonna leak the illicit activity we only got a little bit of money um okay it says fired oh no diplomacy disrupted heart thumping Sawyer backed up the incriminated evidence to a usb drive and hurriedly ex exited the building as she drove to the news agency she nervously glanced in the rearview mirror half expecting to see a black suv trailing her it wasn't long before sawyer's name blew up on social media as the one responsible for exposing government malf malf Malfaisance? Sorry. <laughs> Not sure what that word is. While she was immediately fired, whistleblower regulation saved her from criminal prosecution. She could have been criminally prosecuted. She's sad because she lost her job. Girl, don't worry. We'll be okay. You'll be fine. Does your husband have a job? Yeah. Oh, he's a movie theater employee. Because he's lazy. Okay. Well, that's interesting. So, and what is your... She has 10 days till she ages up. I'm going to get her the um, potion of youth because I'm, I'm not going to have her take it right now but I want her to um, be younger than her sister still so you want to stargaze with your dad that's so cute that is literally so cute Sawyer I feel like is like so like I don't know I don't know what I was going to say I feel like she is yep I brain lost the thought go share brilliant ideas oh my goodness oh I didn't even see pay Oh my goodness, I didn't even see you here. Do you know your... Yeah, you know Paisley. Paige knows Paisley. But, okay. Um. Oh, we're going to go talk to your husband. They're so cute. They're so cute. Look at them. Aww. So this house, it does look like I did slightly give this house a makeover. Or at least, not a makeover, but I mean I at least, like, added some things that I like and whatnot. So that'll be good. Um. Oh no. Why are you going to shout for forbid forbidden words at your daughter? I don't understand. I don't want you to do that. Can you critique? I want you to critique some work somewhere. Okay, you want to browse Simpedia. Why don't you go ahead and do that right now? Web browse Simpedia. Okay, okay, okay. Um, I cannot believe she just got fired. Again, I'm not really sure what to have her do at the moment. Um, with About a job. I feel like obviously she can't get one right now anyway because she just got fired. So, but I feel like it'd be really easy for her to get hired. You can critique this work here. I feel like it'd be really easy for her to get hired since um, she did, like, do the government a favor, you know? So let's flirt. Um, oh, he has, like, oh, he wants to try for a baby with Sawyer. <gasps> and she wants to have a baby, too. Oh, my goodness. Guys, we're going to have Sawyer have another baby. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. Um, we'll have her, like, figure that out in the morning because I don't know if she is, like, if we'll need to take a fertility potion or something, but we're going to have her go to sleep. They're both going to go sleep. And then, um, Paige, let's have Paige go use the bathroom. This is her room here, which is really cute, but we'll have to, I'll have to update that up a little bit as well <laughs> since it is, um, quite literally, like, for a child and she's a teen now. So 
I'll take care of that in a second. Um, oh, you kind of have to pee too. We'll let you go as soon as you wake up because she doesn't have to go like that bad. Um, it does look like she's going to be the first one to wake up though. However, fired. Oh no. Okay. Go ahead and, um, use the restroom and then we'll have her brush her teeth and take a shower. And I also think we need to order groceries. So that's going to happen. Um, order a delivery, order a grocery delivery. We'll get some carrots, tomato, onion, mushroom. Um, we'll also get a dozen eggs and basil, milk, flour, red meat, chicken, um, ooh, pumpkin spice milk. Let's just get that because why not? Um, an apple, coconut, um, and some raspberries. Let's do that. We'll order those for everybody. And then Kevin over here, he is going to come and he is going to, um, have some, oh, there is a bunch of breakfast left though. So he'll just go eat that and brush your teeth. And then Sawyer, um, oop, we need to put this in here. Oh, and then now it looks like Paige is awake. Paige, my dear, Paige, my dear. Let's go have you brush your teeth. And I feel like there's a lot of things that she needs to do. Maybe not, maybe not that much. But it is Monday, so she would technically have her first day of school today. But maybe I will just have her, let's see. Let's see if she needs to, she doesn't have to go to the doctor. Does anybody have to go to the dentist? Let's see. Does anybody need a dental appointment? No. Okay. So I'm going to have her um, take a quick vacation day because we're going to have her get vaccinated. Where are you? Right here. We're going to have her go and get um, vaccinated and an allergy shot. And then Sawyer is going to go and she is going to wait a second how do I I thought that there was a fertility options I want to see if if um there's supposed to be a thing that lets her check to see how fertile she is so wait reassign based on creosome fertility. No. Okay. Well, we're just going to see. Oh, she's at 10. Oh no. That's not good. That's not very high at all. Okay. Well, we're going to get this started and then, um, we're going to buy fertility, purchase a fertility potion and then we're going to drink it. And then Paige is going to go and um, get an allergy shot that'll help with her general allergies. So you have taken, did you drink it yet? Drink. Can you please drink that? Okay. So then, um, we're going to have her come here and they're going to try for a baby. Um, I really, really, really hope that it'll work and that she'll become pregnant. Um, it's definitely going to be, going to be hard. Okay because she is only has like 20% chance of becoming pregnant. So that's definitely going to be difficult. I wonder like what Paige is going to feel about that, you know, because Paige has always been the only child. So I feel like she could really get jealous, you know, so she's going to go ahead and eat. Um, you're not going to eat that for breakfast, Franks and beans. Ew. Oh my goodness. So cute. Oh, we got some bills. How much are the bills? Oh, no. Okay, they're not, like, terrible, but they're definitely, definitely very, very expensive. Thousands of millions, especially for the family. Okay, go and take a pregnancy test. Oh, no, she's not pregnant. No. That is so sad. Okay, why isn't it telling me that we can have her... If we get another potion, will that make her even more? I don't know. Let's just have them try again. That is making me so sad, though, because I really, really, really want her to have a baby. Okay, my dear Paige, you're over here. You're going to wash the dishes. Um, why don't we have you go ahead and use the bathroom as well? Um, she does want to, I do want her to start writing and see if she even likes it. 
so she can start writing a, a children's book. But she does need to write while inspired, so maybe we'll have her take, hang on, I want you to take a thoughtful shower, and maybe that'll help. Okay. Can you go take another pregnancy test? Oh my goodness, excuse me. We're the ones that need to see you. Oh, Myra, I swear, Emiliano Martinez Swan, yes. Um, For some reason, I we know the family. Oh no, she's still not pregnant, you guys. I don't know. She's really sad. Okay, give yourself a pep talk. You're going to be okay. I don't know if she's going to be able to have a baby. We might have to adopt, maybe. I don't know. Okay, Um, I want you to write. Anyway, you guys, um, we will just have to kind of pop in and have you guys see the um, fertility journey for this, our girl Sawyer, um, who again, oh, I really hope that she's able to have a baby. She really wants a baby. <laughs> So we'll just have to see. We'll have to have them try again. But anyway, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I hope you all have a joyful day. If you, um, I literally me forgetting my outro. But anyway, you guys, um, happy summer is out.